Sarah. Look at my adorable new puppy. If you're new around here, I just got her. Her name is Indy. Indy, say hi to the people <laughs> of YouTube. Be sure to like the video and subscribe if you like Indy. Show her some love. Also today, I'm super excited because my friend Sarah Beth from Simple Journeys Travel is here with me today. So we recently went on a restore spree, I guess. Um, we decided to go thrift store shopping together one day and we got some awesome deals. So we wanted to share with you guys how we were able to get $250 worth of retail product for under $20. I know, it's crazy. We were just like so in shock. So we were like, okay, we're making a video about this. Like we have to share this with people. It was totally insane. So keep watching till the end and we'll give you a breakdown of all the numbers and everything. So I'm going to let Sarah Beth go ahead and get started showing what she got and telling the awesome prices. Yeah, so um, I didn't get as much as Sarah here, but um, I... Shocking because I'm the minimalist. Right? Yeah. You just inspired me to be so minimalist. <laughs> so I only got three items, but I got two pairs of jeans and this shirt. And these three pieces, retail price is $105, but I bought two pairs of jeans and a shirt for $3.30. That's crazy. And 30 cents. So which one was your most expensive piece? So one of the pairs of jeans retails for $55. Oh my goodness, that's crazy. Like, yeah. I didn't know spend that much money on jeans. Right? But I got them for $1.60, which I thought was, you know, just a little bit more reasonable. What is, like, the percentage of that? Like, so, um, I, whenever we went, to, when we went to the thrift store, they were having a ninety percent off sale. Uh -huh. So and all of our clothing like was ninety percent off. Um, Almost all of it. Some of my stuff wasn't. Like that's not true. all of it. All of my stuff, stuff was ninety percent off. <laughs> that was my that was my haul. Two pairs of jeans and that's a shirt amazing. for three dollars and thirty cents. So. That is great. Like you cannot be that anywhere. No. You can't go to the Dollar Tree <laughs> and buy three items of clothing that are going to be like that. No, no. Like it's insane. Yeah, there's no way. So I didn't get as many clothes as she did, but I got more stuff overall and spent more money. Um, so I'm going to pass Indy to you. Cool. So I'm going to start with my one piece of clothing. Um, I got a Pico, you guys. Like a name brand Pico shirt. I love it. And of course it's gray because my life is gray and black and like just neutral. Devoid or void? What's the right word? Uh, void. void. Yeah. Void of color. My mother always tells me, you need more colors in your closet. And I'm like, no, I don't. I need more <laughs> black and gray in my closet. So now I got this gray Pico for 70 cents. Like I just so couldn't believe crazy. that. It was 70 cents. That's a dollar. That's insane. For a Pico. Then two of probably my favorite things were these adorable booties that I got. Both of these. So Super I read them my price on my little cheat sheet. One of them was two ninety five, like two dollars and ninety five cents. I feel like so I have to great. clarify. Right, you do, you do. <laughs> and then the other was a dollar forty. So I mean, both of them were under three dollars each, which to me is mind blowing. Um, I don't know if I held those up well enough for you guys. Super awesome score. But you can wear them with like. I anything. love those right there. Those are. I know so these cute. are a little bit more dressy because they have a heel, and these are a bit more. I don't know, just like. Casual, but trying to look a little bit cute. <laughs> um, speaking of that, I also got this scrunchie. This was one of the most expensive purchases for me out of the whole thing, which is crazy. Like, the scrunchie cost more than the shoes. so much. I did. I was like, you know what? Just live your life. Just, just <laughs> do it. So, the scrunchie was like $2.99 or something. But um, it's a nice way to just... Don't eat my toy. <laughs> it's a nice way to just add some detail to an outfit. If I'm going to throw my hair up in a bun anyway, I might as well have a cute scrunchie. So then, let's talk jewelry. Okay, so I don't know if you guys can see these earrings that I'm wearing right now, but these were super cheap, and I just love them. I haven't been wearing big earrings since having my son because he's a toddler still, and would, like, pull at it and, like, mm, try to hurt me. Scary. So I'm not going to wear these around him just yet. Maybe, like, on dates or, like, if I know I'm not with him. But I did get these other small ones, which I love so much. They're just little bitty, like, beige hoops. And I think they're pretty cool because sometimes they look like I have gauges because they match my skin color. So, I love those. I got another necklace right here. It's just a really long gold chain with some white beads. You could layer it up. And then this was the most expensive purchase of all. It was so this necklace. Spend that much on a necklace. I oh know. It was $3. <laughs> so this one was not on sale, which is why it was the full price of $3. <laughs> but I love it so much. I've already worn it a few times because it just matches with everything. So let's look at grand totals. I have my receipt here with me. You can see I spent $13.11 on all of this. 
And let me look at the retail, what was it? The retail value for everything was $148. Like that's just crazy. Yeah, that's like, so, that's mind blowing. Right I there. know, like we looked at the different brands and everything and did the math and worked it all out. And it was uh, like almost 150 bucks for $13. So all in all, we spent less than $20 and got $250 worth of yeah, product. It was yeah. awesome. So would you do it again? Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm like, what are they going to have another right? sale so we can come back? So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I hope it has helped you see that you really can find good deals. Sometimes you just have to wait for the right sale or go to the right thrift store to get those awesome deals and to be wearing clothes that are stylish and modern but on a budget. So, anyhow, I want to say thank you again to Sarah Beth for being here with Thanks us. Thanks for having me. Yes, yeah, show her some love. Hit the little love button so she'll know or the like button, whatever it is. <laughs> Instagram, YouTube, I'm getting confused. Show her some love here as well for being here with us. And then in the comments, I want them to tell us the best deal. So what's the yes. best deal that you have ever gotten on anything, whether it's from a thrift store or like a regular name brand retail store. Let us know down below what you got and what budget it was on. So thank you guys for watching and be sure to say bye to Indy. Oh, Indy, <laughs> say bye-bye. <laughs> Thanks guys, bye.